Okay, so now we're going to learn about AM, AM and PM. AM is in the morning, PM is at night. Uh, we'll learn some more, but that's what you need to know for right now. So morning, what it wants me to do here is it wants me to draw something I do in the morning and then write the time. So this is my drawing of brushing my teeth in the morning. Okay, and I'm gonna just say I brush my teeth at mm, 6.30 in the morning. Okay, so I'm gonna write it 6.30 so I can remember. And since it's 30, remember it's half. We learned last uh, time that 30 is, is um, half. So I can look right here in the middle. I'll draw my, my minute hand right there. And then six should be right in between my, my hour hand, right in between the six and the seven, right? Okay, and this would be, whoops, AM. I'm just gonna write AM right here. Okay, and evening, this is what I made for evening, me sleeping. And I'm gonna say I go to sleep at, um, I go to sleep at 9.30. Nine, actually let's do 9.45. Okay. So let's find 45. I'll do my minute hand, then I'll do my hour hand. So let's skip count, remember? 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 9, right there, 45. Okay. And it's nine nine o'clock so I don't make my hour hand right here I don't make my hour hand right here I'll make it in the middle whoops kind of got a little bit crazy there there we go <laughs> 9 p.m. so what I want you to do on this page so I want you to draw something you do in the morning and then pick a time that you want it and then I want you to draw something you do in the evening and pick a time Okay, let's look at this page. Noon is 12 in the daytime. Midnight is 12 at night. So times after midnight and before noon are written with AM. So if it's like 3 AM at nighttime, if it, it'd still be dark, but it's 3 AM because it's after midnight, after 12 at night. Um, it's AM until 11. And then after 11, it will be p.m. So times after noon and before midnight are written with p.m. 11 p.m. is in the evening. So 11 p.m. is when people go to sleep. So it could start at 12 p.m. That's the time people eat lunch. It's in the afternoon. 12 p.m., 1 p.m., 3 p.m. is when we, we are getting ready to go, well, 2.45 p.m. is when we're getting ready to go home from school. So this is in the morning, or the early, early hours in the morning. And this is in the afternoon, or the evening. Okay, I will, we'll take some, we'll practice it. Because I know it can be a little confusing. Write the time, then circle a.m. or p.m. We eat breakfast. So, 7.15, that's a.m. We eat breakfast. We go to art class at... Let's see, it's in, it's two? Nope, not two. One. One, what is this? Remember, this was 45, so back five is 40. 140, okay. Is this a.m. or p.m.? So, this right here is a.m., Remember, this is like 11 a.m. That's when we eat lunch. Then next would be 12 p.m. So 1 would be what? 1 p.m., 1.40 p.m. 1.40 a.m., we would be asleep. Okay, that would be right after midnight, and it would be a.m. Let's do this one. We do homework at not 5, 4 30. What do you think this is? AM or PM? So I, this is the afternoon, right? We're not asleep. 
afternoon is p.m. Okay. We arrive at school. Let's see. What time is it? Eight. And what's the five? Let's skip count. Well, this is 30, actually. Go back. Five would be 25. So, what time do we get at school? We get at school in the morning, so it would be a.m. Okay, here's some stuff that you can practice with on your own. Um, what you'll do here is you'll fill in the blanks. Don got to school at blank. His class went to the library at blank. After school, Don read a book at blank. So we have 10.15 a.m., 3.20 p.m., 8.30 p.m. AM. Figure out where those go. Okay. Sometimes are shown on the time sometimes are shown on the timeline. Write a label for each dot that names something you do during the, that part of the day. So I can help you with this. Um something we do between 8 a.m. to 10 a.m. Uh, you can pick anything we do, but sometimes we have art class, so I'll write art. Okay, and then this one, noon. Remember, noon is 12 to 2 p.m. Um, let's see, we have math or gym or um, anything else you can think of. At what times would you say the dots are placed on the dot line? So let's see, if this is 8 a.m., this is 10 a.m., what do you think that would be? I'm thinking, what's between 8 and 10? 9, right? So I'm going to think it's 9 a.m. All of them in the room. Okay, and this, noon. So 10 a.m., 11 a.m., 12 a.m., what's in here? And what's right before 2? We'll say 1 a.m. Or not 1 a.m., ooh, we'd be asleep. 2 p.m., that's the afternoon. Now, noon is when it switches over. So this would be, this we would start saying p.m. here. Okay. And then do this. The clock shows the time Jane got goes to recess. Write the time, then circle a.m. or p.m. So let's see. This is pretty easy. We know this is 30, right? And this is, we go back to the smaller number, 11. 11.30. Is it a.m. or p.m.? So it's not noon yet. It's not 12. It's still 11. So we would say it's a.m. We were at recess. Now if it said, um, if it said the clock shows the time you go to bed, then we would circle p.m. And it says recess lasted one hour. Write the time recess was over. Okay, so it lasts one hour. Ooh, that's a long recess. We're going to change this, right? 12, because it lasts one hour. That means the, the hand goes all the way around the clock. So if this goes all the way around the clock, it would be back here, and it would be 12.30. Now, is it a.m. or is it p.m.? I just said if this, when this goes on to here, it will be p.m. So now, 12.30 would be p.m. It's in the afternoon. <clears throat> okay, let's see. You can do this page by yourself, and this page uh, by yourself.